Spice up your presentations. Mastering animations and transitions. Hello learners. Today, we're diving into an exciting topic in presentation design. Using animations and transitions. These elements can make your presentations more dynamic and engaging. But remember, balance is key. Too little might make your presentation dull, and too much might distract your audience. So, let's explore how to use them effectively. Firstly, what are animations and transitions? In presentation design, animations are movements applied to objects, like text or images, on a single slide. They can include entrances, exits, emphasis effects, and motion paths. On the other hand, transitions are visual effects that occur when moving from one slide to the next. Examples include fades, wipes, and dissolves. Animations can help guide your audience's focus. They can emphasize a key point, show a process, or make your presentation more lively. For instance, you might use a zoom in animation to highlight an important statistic. Or, you might use a motion path to show a process flow. However, it's crucial to use animations sparingly and purposefully. Similar to animations, transitions can also add a level of professionalism and fluidity to your presentation. They help to maintain the audience's attention as you move from one point to another. A fade transition can be used for smooth progressions, while a wipe transition might signify a stronger change in topic. Again, overuse can be distracting, so keep it minimal and consistent. When it comes to incorporating animations and transitions, the keyword is balance. Use them to enhance comprehension and maintain interest, not to overshadow your content. Ensure they align with your presentation's tone. For a serious business presentation, subtle animations and smooth transitions might be best. For a creative or casual presentation, you might opt for more dynamic effects. Incorporating animations and transitions can truly elevate your presentations, making them more engaging and effective. But remember, they are there to support your content, not to take center stage. So, go ahead and start experimenting, but always keep your audience and purpose in mind. Hope you found this video helpful, and happy presenting!